That's all I wanted to know. Fair enough. I should go. As you wish. Something is troubling me, Inquisitor. Leliana is receiving reports of mages becoming possessed, Templars going rogue. No one is dealing with these matters. I was hoping we might, before they get worse. We can certainly look into it. I will mark these incidents on the map as I learn of them, Inquisitor. And I would be pleased to accompany you if and when you investigate. So, you're a candidate for Divine now? So I am informed. Is that something you actually want? Why should what I want matter? Maybe it shouldn't. It is very simple. The Chantry needs to survive. To do that, it must change. I have never believed in asking another to do what you are unwilling to do yourself. So I look upon this as an opportunity. I owe it to myself and all of Thedas to seek the Sunburst throne. I think you'd make an excellent choice. Thank you. Let's hope the Chantry clerics agree. Can you tell me more about the Seekers? The Seekers of Truth were born from the original Inquisition long ago, when it united with the Chantry. Seekers stood above the Templars, watching over them but also investigating magical events they couldn't handle. We were meant to be incorruptible, above reproach. How seldom does reality match the ideal? How does someone become a Seeker? Most Seekers begin training in their youth. I was much older, an exception due to my noble birth. We train rigorously for years. Our bodies and minds must be elastic to undergo the vigil, and most fail even then. Is the vigil some kind of initiation? It is the rite every Seeker must go through in order to summon their gift. A full year of fasting, prayer, and separation from all distractions, including other people. We empty ourselves of all emotion, focusing only on the purity of our devotion. And the moment it finally ends, it's wonderful. Faith realized. I cannot put it into words. Was it some kind of magic? I don't fully understand it, to be honest. If the vigil was not so arduous, I'd say more should attempt it. What if mages never needed to fear possession by demons? I'm told it is impossible, however. I suppose I'll never know the truth of it now. But what are Seekers exactly? Those who know anything of us think we are Templars. We do not use Lyrium, however. Our abilities are different, as was our original purpose. We disciplined the Templars and were accountable only to the Divine, and not even her, truthfully. So the Seekers... commanded the Templars? No. The Order didn't assume command until after the Rebellion. The Templars have always feared us. 
When a seeker arrived at a circle, they knew trouble was afoot. That kind of power is troubling. You begin to think you are the only one who can solve the world's problems. If you don't see a problem, it doesn't exist. If someone insists it does, they are the blind ones. Do you think that kind of problem could ever be fixed? Possibly. Though the Seekers themselves would need to change. They were clearly not willing to, even though they abandoned everything they stood for to avoid it. In my heart, I believe they can still be salvaged, but not by their own hands. Why did your order turn against the Chantry? We originally united with the Chantry through a treaty that stated they would keep mages under control. It was felt Most Holy had tacitly allowed the Circle of Magi to vote on its independence, thus breaking the treaty. The Seekers saw themselves as justified, and they led the Templars into a war of righteousness. You sound like you disagree. We knew what was happening at Kirkwall, where the Mage Rebellion began. We looked into reports of Knight Commander Meredith's harsh treatment of her charges years earlier. But we found so many shocking cases of magical corruption, it was decided her actions were justified. If we'd been there when it happened, if we'd looked harder at the root causes, Mages were oppressed. What else did you expect? I expected us to do better. When faced with a problem, the Seekers would close ranks and crush it. We would find an answer, but only once we felt we weren't being coerced. The moment the Mages voted for independence, our response was predictable. It was difficult to watch. <laughs> 